Tonight at NSA Wisconsin, Ford Sakes did a sensational job of giving us great ideas and then providing us the skills on how to implement those ideas right away, especially in regards to social media marketing and our websites. Now, what's the number one reason somebody goes on the internet? They're looking for an answer. They're looking for solutions for some issue, some challenge, maybe some problem in their life, maybe something they're dealing with at work. And so if they're going on the internet looking for solutions, well, when they get to your website, are they finding solutions? Or they just find a lot of text and content about you and your organization? I know it's normal to want to tell people about your organization when they first get to your website because you want to think, well, I want them to get comfortable with me, know a little bit about me, so then we can help them. The problem is they're not looking for you. They are looking for the solution. They are looking for the help. So give it to them. You really focus the website on them and the solution they're looking for. Then they'll learn about you. Then they'll check you out because you'll be providing them something they can really use and they need and you'll be extremely helpful to them. And the great part was that Ford shared how to do this with social media. You know, whether you're doing internet marketing sites like Facebook, social marketing sites, social networking sites like LinkedIn, whatever those sites might be, you can really utilize them nowadays. I'll give you a great example. Our organization is called the Date Safe Project and it is our mission to do three things. Number one, really teach parents, educators, and teenagers how asking first makes all the difference for dating to become more safer and more fun at the same time. The second mission is that we teach how to intervene when you're at a party, you're at an event, you're even downtown at a club if you're in college, and you see somebody trying to use alcohol to take advantage of another person sexually. We're going to give you the skills on how to really intervene, stop that from happening, really looking out for other people. And number three, when something does go wrong, somebody is taken advantage of, somebody is sexually assaulted, we're going to give you all the skills you need to really support that person you care about who's a survivor, really help them move forward, take that next step. Well, the media, the internet media, which is, for instance, YouTube, is a great resource. Why? Well, let's say that a, a case breaks in the news. All the news is talking about the sexual assault case. Now, the reason the news is probably talking about it is because a celebrity is involved. So everybody sort of reads the hype about the celebrity case. However, we're going to make sure that we're going to immediately get on, make a quick film like we're doing right here, right now for you, throw it up onto YouTube, and we're going to make sure that this video that we make real quickly is going to address the issue that the media is, is talking about, that case, that celebrity case. However, we're not going to get caught up in the hype. We're not going to give all the negative energy the media is going to do. Nope. Instead, we're going to bring it up and we're going to give parents how to talk about this case with their teenager. We're going to give educators how to bring this up in the classroom. We're going to give students, hey, have you heard about this case? What are your friends saying? Hey, how about asking your friends this? Really challenge them to think about this case. Look at it a different way. Now we're going to use this quick little video off a current news story to totally revolutionize the way people are talking about this issue in their own lives. Why? Because we quickly got a video up there, we went on to YouTube, showed people how to do it, and now they do it in their own lives. And the cool thing is that while they're watching our video on YouTube, like you're watching this video right now, you're going to notice that the website's right here, just like it will be on YouTube, right? And there's my name. So what can you do? You, think, you might be sitting here right now be thinking, hey, you know what, I'm a parent, I've got a teenager, I'm curious by what Mike's saying, what solutions exactly does he have? Go check it out. Website's right below me, right? Datesafeproject.org. See, this video is a great example of what Ford taught us tonight. How to utilize a resource that we have sitting right in front of us, waiting for us to utilize to really make an impact on this world and our businesses and other people's lives. You've got all the tools you'll need. Check out Ford Sakes. Check out NSA Wisconsin and all the information you can learn about that last meeting. And hey, yeah, if you're wondering, you got a teenager, maybe you know somebody's got a teenager, come check us out. Datesafeproject.org.